What's up everybody, this is JB from Wheel With Me, and today I wanted to show you guys how you can quickly and easily repair a stripped thread. You only need to pick up a couple things, I will leave them linked for you guys down below. You need to pick up this Helicoil Repair Kit, which comes with 12 of these threaded inserts and this insert tool. It also comes with this tap. The only separate thing you need to pick up is this T-handle here, which holds your tap, and it also holds the insert tool. All right, so your first step is to remove your foot pad, which I've already done to save some time. Get rid of this screw here. Um, a second thing that I wanna point out is um, we're basically just going to be tapping in a new thread here. So you wanna keep this as straight as possible. So maybe put a box or a block or something under your one wheel to keep it flat, which will help you keep this straight. For the sake of this video, I will just try to keep this as straight as I possibly can. I'm gonna go ahead and zoom in here a bit. All right, so like I said, just insert your tap into the T-handle, and then we're just going to tap out a new thread. Super easy. Like I said, keeping this as straight as possible. You wanna put a little bit of pressure into this, not too much, um, just a little bit of pressure, and it will start, you'll start to feel it threading out a new hole here. Doesn't take much time at all. And I can really feel it start to get tight right now. Um, this is the first time I've ever had to repair back threads. Normally they're on the bottom or they're on the front. So this one is going into where the battery compartment is. It's, they're a little bit tighter of a fit than the ones on the front, but it's okay. It'll be all right. Perfect. All right, so back this out. And then just blow out any metal that's in there. All right, so now we're going to go and grab a Healy coil. I've got one right here. Um, they're a little bit long for these rails, so I'm gonna take a pair of pliers, and I'm gonna trim a little bit of this off. Now there's two sides to this. It's hard to see on camera here. One side has what they call a tang, and that is this piece down the middle. That is That goes towards the bottom. Do not cut that off. You need that to install. So we're gonna go on the side here that's wide open, and I'm just gonna go down about three rungs and take my pliers and trim it off. This is not necessary, you don't have to do this. I just don't like how long these are. All right, so there we go. So now we wanna take our insert tool. We're going to take the uh, tap out of this handle. We're going to put the insert tool into the handle and tighten it up. All right, so now you're gonna go ahead and take your insert tool and slide it in to this plastic with the rounded part at the bottom. Go ahead and take your Healy coil with again the tang pointed downward and put it right inside like that. And so the tang will catch on to the bottom of the insert tool. And press it up against here. You don't need to press too much pressure or you will break that tang. And then just start twisting. Again, keep this as straight as possible. Do not go in at an angle. If you press too hard, you'll break the tang and you'll have to start from the beginning. I've done that multiple times. All right, so now I'm almost all the way in and now I only wanna go about another quarter turn. So turn just to get that top part in. All right, that's a oh, little bit more. All right, now go ahead and back it out. And there we go. Um, one last thing that we have to do is break the tang off in here. So usually what I do is I will take an Allen key, stick it in here, I'll zoom out a little bit for you guys. And then I'll take like my, just my hand or something and boom, break down and now I broke the tang off. All right, there we go guys, the strip thread is no more. Let's go ahead and insert a screw here just to make sure and awesome, look at that. It's going right in, no problems at all. Goodbye strip threads. Um, if you guys have any questions about this, leave them down below, I will help you out to the best that I can. But if this video helps you out, consider subscribing, give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.